What's up guys, Purple Lotus Samsara here. So it's no secret my love for India. Most of my videos are filmed in India. Just got back from India. I eat mostly Indian food. We sponsor children from India. I've worked in India, briefly lived in India, and will return to India many, many more times as long as this life allows me to. So today, I'm gonna go check out this place called the Bollywood Theater. Super good street food. Kati rolls, Goan style shrimp, curries, they have uh, raitas you can get, parathas in a tandoor. They make them right like you're on the streets in New Delhi or in Calcutta or even Kerala way down in the bottom of India. So this place here, the Bollywood Theater, a lot of memorabilia from old Bollywood movies. They play old black and white movies on the screen and uh, it smells super ridiculously good in there. So let's go check it out from here and uh, see what's going on. We've got all of these here. You can check out this stuff up here. Like this would be Dev Anand. Dev Anand um, was an old Bollywood actor. He wasn't allowed to wear black at one point in his career because like uh, people would jump off these uh, buildings and commit suicide because they were so much in love with Dev Anand. Do you see all of these things and you can see some of the cooks here. So they got a lot of a lot of stuff. A lot of memorabilia here. You can see a movie going on up here. It's like super cool. You got like lots of street foods in here. Let's so let's check out this map. Uh, this menu. Let's see what they got. So it's like Bollywood Theater, Street Food, Bell Puri, Papaji, Alu Tiki, Lamb Samosas, all kinds of curries, all kinds of tali meals. If you look here, it's super awesome. They got all this other stuff. They got a bunch of Sanskrit writings up here. Let's see if you come through here, they got like all kinds of things like. Hinduism for our time, from Arvind Sharma. All kinds of little things that you would find like in a, uh, like a museum or something of old type of India. But they also have a place called Salt and Straw, which is like a staple here in this city. Probably check that out later. They make fresh ice cream and they have all kinds of little concoctions that they make. So we're waiting for the food we um, much anticipate going to this place here. I don't think that they're even open. So we can go check it out here in the Bollywood Theater and get situated with whatever movie they're playing. So let's go check this out and see if the hype is real or is it just smoke and mirrors here. I mean, even in the bathroom, they got cool stuff. They got a screen here in the bathroom. Tell her, Telegrams in Devanagari script are accepted here. I probably butchered this pronouncing pronunciation here So this is pretty cool. Uh, lots of stuff here. Lakshmi Hospital two-wheeler parking Awesome, so it looks like you're coming out of like a train cart That's cool. This is cool so They play Bollywood movies on the wall like you can see here and I got some of my food, quick peek. Got some of his food. We're waiting for everything so we can get it all at one time and we can explain. So the moment of truth is here. We are waiting with all of our food from like four different states in India. West Bengal, Kanti Rose from the streets of Calcutta. I got Choli, India Delhi, mostly Choli. Goan style shrimp, paratha, sambar, lamb samosa. Kerala style fried chicken from Kerala. So we're eating from northern all the way down to Kerala, southern India. So we're gonna dig into this and eat them. I just spilled this on my finger. And fill you guys in. We're still watching old Bollywood movies. So now we can eat.
I got all this stuff I gotta try. Like this coffee roll. You have like cabbage, chicken that is marinated in a ton of spices. You can get it with an egg, double egg, double chicken. One chicken, two egg. Lots of combinations when you order them on the streets in India. Take a bite of this real quick. Even this going south shrimp looks super ridiculous. Try some of this here. Wow. That is super, super ridiculous. Neighbor. Not even super spicy, even with this here. So, coffee roll. Cook them in like a big thing, like a big fat of oil, mustard oil, whatever it is. Um, making the breads, you can eat them primarily in, uh, in uh, Calcutta. You can eat them, it's good. This might be a coriander leaf, I think. No, it's not. Tastes good. A cardamom leaf? I don't know. Mm -hmm. Lamb samosa. Yeah. I've never actually tried a lamb samosa. Like minced, minced lamb, peas, spices. Ridiculously good. Ridiculously. Choli. Find them everywhere on the streets of New Delhi. You get a serving like this probably for about 25 cents. Not here. Ten times more than twenty times. So now this meal is coming to a close. Getting really full. Everything's almost done. Samosa's done. Holly meal is done. Everything's done. The choli is almost done. It reminds me of a little street alleys where you can see all the cycle rickshaw drivers. They crowd around with their carts and they buy this stuff because they're so cheap. And I'm getting really, really stuffed. Bollywood movie still going. Bollywood theater. Just opened probably way more places at night. It's ridiculously good. Fair price. Try it out. One of many different restaurants. Feels like maybe you went to travel thousands of miles within the state or uh, country of India, eating one lunch, four different states. Super good.